first of all good evening yes good evening how are you how are you i am well thank you for asking me what about you yes i am also doing great so can i introduce myself because this video is for you so, okay so as you know my name is ruby i am connecting with you from ghaziabad this is the city of uttar pradesh and speaking about my qualification i have done post graduation in political science and in addition i have a bachelor of education as well when it comes to my pride and joy movement so now day i am learning this language so i love read books and apart from that i love to talk with a stranger i mean co learner that's all about for me from my side i start asking some questions so as you know now days for learning this language reading is very important so what do you think but people are neglecting especially reading they thought that it especially they feel lethargic now they have come to so many of people and they want to read but they say that it's, it's like a boring when we read book so can you tell me how can they how can they overcome this type of problem how yes, can they implement yes yes so very good question and i was also facing the same problem start with one page a day that will be my recommendation for anyone who wants to uh, develop the habit of reading so what do you yes, think yes. yeah yeah even i my point of view on this point how to start reading book especially if you want to learn this language because nowadays i'm all recently not recently i have been starting reading book last 2 to 3 months and before that i also thought like that how can i read book because the time taking process and, and sometimes feel like a bore when we read especially book but uh, even i can say it's my new hobby and you are absolutely right we should start with reading one or two pages if you thought like that we can read just a 10 to 12 page 15 page so sometimes it's like a um burden i feel that i am saying my experience say something yeah yeah i am saying that uh, i am saying my experience how i started reading, reading uh, how i started uh, adopting this uh, inculcate this habit even initially there uh, initially day i thought that is is a burden but gradually i can say it's my new hobby i started with reading two to three pages because my main motto is that i want to learn this language if you have any motto and then you, you are working on it so you will not feel bored you will not feel like, not feel feel like a burden if you have any motto and the second thing if you want to start reading book so your genre and your level it's also very really crucial don't choose any hard level book and uh, especially newspaper some people says that if you want to start uh, if you want to learn this language so you should start with newspaper and uh, i am saying that uh, if you are beginner so newspaper is really tough for beginner especially because the word is too difficult and the sentence is so is also too difficult so we should start with simple books especially story book maybe that's beneficial if you if you have you if you have a, a idea about your genre and your level so you will not feel bored you will not feel burden you can easily inculcate this type of habit this is my point of view on this topic on this point yes yes yeah. true very true because uh, reading newspapers you know sometimes uh, it becomes a tedious task because uh, they use a lot of advanced words and the yes. complex sentence structures which uh, uh is very difficult to understand especially for a beginner and also uh, for an intermediate learner yes. so um i used to read newspapers because it was required for my uh, to clear yes. my competitive okay. exam so that was only you know study it's not like to learn something just to study the newspaper as a subject so um, so uh, now i do not uh, read newspapers now um, as you know i read books so um, yes. as a beginner you should start reading a uh, children's book like yes. panchatantra and you know moral story book then there are uh, various authors who write in simple uh, and easy language they use simple and easy language while writing um, such as uh, sudha murthy ma'am so yes. uh, you She's can read my favorite yes and also there are other uh, authors also indian authors they uh, you know they mostly use um, simple language but uh, 
it depends on which uh, which genre uh, you are reading and uh, depending on that genre and depending on that topic you have to uh, you have to uh, come across certain you know vocabulary that is apt for that topic so a uh, uh, an author has to use those uh, you know vocabulary words and uh, it's evident that you uh, don't know the meaning because uh, you do not come across uh, these words too often because uh, they are used in writing but while conversing with people we do not use those words so uh, it sometimes it becomes uh, difficult to start a book because of this reason but uh, i want to say that uh, don't uh, like don't uh, think like this that no uh, the words are too difficult and uh, it's not possible for me to read the book see some words will always be there no matter what book you are reading so try yes. to write those words and the the um, the interesting uh, thing is that those words keep getting repeated inside the whole book so once you uh, know the meaning once you search on google uh, the meaning of one word and next time when you come across the same word so it would be it would be you know uh, easy for you to understand the context because you already know the meaning you have searched it and you know the meaning so uh, so just start and uh, write two three words you know per page write two three words and you know the write down also the meaning so that it uh, would be easy for you to um, to read the whole book okay uh, one question is also occurring in my mind this time yeah you uh, are reading books even you know about now they books has lost its popularity after social media you know even uh, i told you recently i started and started the reading book but uh, i really like w- watching videos even nowadays because really easy is to understand even the audio visual things so what do you think book is more important or uh, watching videos which one is more important uh i will say that watching videos is important um, and it will help you to speak but when it comes to reading a book then uh, it actually uh, how you prefer it like some people do prefer reading a book uh, to watching a video and some people prefer you know watching a video always uh, to reading a book so i prefer reading a book and okay. i find it really relaxing and you know i find it really nice when i read something and especially when i read and complete a book i feel so sat- i feel sat- i feel a sense of satisfaction inside me i don't know why and uh, you know uh, when you read a book um, i think that you Uh, go into the world of other person yeah. you know the author imaginary they... yeah yes. imaginary even now i can feel during reading what what is the scenario even i also feel yes, yes because you are absolutely some, right yes because you know some authors uh, describe a situation uh, suppose uh, he he is entering into a room and he describes the room so this so uh, they describe it so beautifully that you can you know you can actually see those things in front of you so uh, yes. you can get those feelings while reading a book i don't think you can get the similar feeling uh, when you watch something on uh, on, on video on social media platform yeah of course i mean do you like reading books maybe more uh, more than watching videos yes okay okay so yeah you can ask me yeah yes i want to ask you you which um, you know about cooperation and collaboration which one is lifestyle is better these day Coll- cooperation or compromise cooperation or compromise hmm. cooperation and compromise especially indian scenario 
okay so in indian scenario we tend to compromise a lot uh, in our workplace at our home also um and i think co- cooperation is better than compromise uh, when you cooperate with uh, someone then uh, you need to uh, uh, you need to take the consideration of other perspective also then only you can cooperate with uh, others and uh, you know work uh, in a friendly environment uh, and then i think there will be no need for you to compromise but even indian society especially i have seen around in my society especially homemakers they always face compromise even you you have also seen around in, in your society i think especially women yes yeah uh, she so always doing she so always doing great job she so always putting their heart and soul and but no one can care care her you know no one can support her no one can recognize her are you agree yes. i yes yes i know what you are trying to say yes i do agree i do agree uh, even i see uh, uh, some women face the same issue but uh, you know i uh, i don't know maybe i have not given it a thought like what things i compromise uh, i have compromised or maybe i compromise on a daily basis i don't think about it but i think i'm a very uh, strong headed person and uh, uh, whatever i do i i can take the responsibility for that you know Uh, i am accountable for whatever i do on a daily basis and uh, i think that uh, that is something that makes me dif- different and uh, uh, i do not believe in compromise i if i feel something that i uh, it's not necessary to like i'm a married uh, woman so uh, it's it, it's not necessary to uh, to see i to i with your husband on every single matter so when i don't agree with him i tell him uh, that see i'm feeling like this and i think this should be done like this so can we do that and we discuss it and then we do it accordingly so if you are able to you know do this things i think uh, the compromise uh, amount will be less and you will be more happy because my mostly friends they are married so that's why i'm asking this type of question they always said to me like although they want to do job but their family didn't support they said that if you want to do job so first of all your responsibility you have to do all entire work i, I mean all household chores and then you have to take care of your baby that you have to take care of your family and if you want to do job so it's your responsibility in end of the story so we can see always women i mean girls they have to compromise with their life decisions yeah but we should yes. try to i mean cooperation is much better yeah we should yes. uh, respect everyone's point of view we shouldn't uh, we shouldn't emphasize that you have to do this thing because you are a girl you you are a woman i i have see around in my society that, that's why i'm asking to you this kind of questions Okay, so now I want to ask you a question. What which one? See, suppose you are doing. Suppose now you you have a YouTube channel, and uh, suppose you uh, you get a job. You will get a job, of course, um, uh, as an assistant professor in a college. And suppose after marriage, your in-laws, uh, uh, you know, ask you to leave your job. So what will you do, or maybe what will you say to them? okay so maybe i will first of all i will never resign my job because after putting a hard toil so then i get this job so how can i leave that job yeah i will maybe discuss on this topic i want to do job because it's a need and if i will do jobs because everyone they do job for money yeah it's a motivation and it's really important money for living a healthy lifestyle for i mean comfortable lifestyle so money is really crucial i don't know why people say that money is not important it's important it's a fact i don't know why people say like that so yeah of course i will do job even 
after discussing her, this maybe i will try to um, manage all the thing and i will talk with my i mean my family members but i will never give up yeah i will do and job what if, what if they tell you that you have to do all the household chores and then if you have time then you can continue with your job so what will be your answer we, then we have other substitute now like we uh, you know um, house helper also a choice yeah of course we we have a lot of option but but, but uh, our problem is that now we we also always escape the problem we should try to face it but we can't do this yeah so we should try to solve the problem uh, we should try to discuss how we can solve this problem don't create a yeah. rush yeah now you are answering your own question you ask me na cooperation or compromise now you are you are answering the thing that if you discuss it like this will be the problem and there are different options that we can uh, opt and uh, we can uh, you know minimize the problem then i don't think there will be any requirement of compromise so you you are also saying the same thing so you can say the same thing with your friends also but i say i i say this thing with my friends but their in laws they are not like that yeah yeah even i have qualified not as well it depends on you how uh, you want to lead your life you know if you uh, say that no okay i will do all the household chores and then i will also maintain my work then ultimately you will be the one who suffer and uh, it's your responsibility to uh, decrease your suffering so you have to take that initiative otherwise no one will uh, you know come and help you yeah people just give you piece of advice if you are not to raise your voice so it never it will never work so we should yes. take our stand at least but yes true. but we should take some time yeah so uh, back to the topic so currently what are you reading what book are you reading maybe last time i told you now this i read that book that book called 3000 stitches written by oh. sudha moti ji yes yeah, yes that yes. book is really super awesome i can say i really like the concept yeah it's my second book and before that maybe i share this thing i read that book called atomic habits the book was super the concept is also super but that book was not a piece of cake for me so i switched and now this i read that that's superb yeah yes actually now i also thought of reading the uh, the book that you are currently reading but i am not into like i want to read happy happy ending type book and you know okay. light hearted book comic and uh, where i don't uh, like i don't want to feel sad after reading a book that is why i didn't uh, read the book that you are reading currently because it's okay. it's a somehow it's a sad story no 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 it's not a sad story in this book maybe 10 or 12 stories available and uh, i have already completed maybe seven yeah oh so it's a sad story yes yeah, yes yes in this book 10 to 12 stories available oh yeah. okay wow great yeah. and also i want to okay. congratulate that uh, you have uh, crossed 1000 subscribers yes thank you so yes. okay, okay. Have bye, a bye bye yeah it was really okay. lovely conversation with you okay same to you yes yeah